With Donald Trump assuming the presidency, relations with Mexico reportedly continue to sour. And it's not just about immigration. Water also remains a point of contention. Justin Horn recently spoke with Representative Lyle Larson, who serves on the Southwestern State's Water Commission, about a decades-old treaty that's in danger of dissolving. This is a bad deal for the United States. With changes underway in Washington, Representative Lyle Larson believes it might be time to tighten the screws on our southern neighbor. And we've taken them all the way to The Hague on interna international court trying to resolve this matter, and we can't get it done. The fight over water between the two countries isn't new. A 1944 treaty that stipulates how water would be shared has long been a point of contention. We're always compliant. 100% compliant for the last 50 years. Mexico, however, who is obligated to release 350,000 acre feet annually into the Rio Grande, built up a debt, recently repaying some of the water to the U.S., but not all. It's Lake Am said uh, that that lake will drop sometimes 50 feet because the people in Mexico aren't releasing the 350,000 acre feet of water. From the Amistad Reservoir, the Rio Grande water obviously flows south to Falcon Lake and eventually the valley. And if there is a deficit, it affects everyone who needs water along the way. Del Rio, Eagle Pass, uh, Laredo, all the way down to Brownsville. Larson's solution, if Mexico doesn't release its share into the Rio Grande, would be to hold back water from other waterways in the U.S., namely the Colorado River, a river that is also part of the 1944 treaty. And should that not work? The only thing we can do is walk away from the treaty. Justin Horn, KSAT 12 News. In a recent statement in a South Texas newspaper, the U.S. Commissioner of the International Boundary and Water Commission, Edward Dracina, voiced opposition to Larson's views of withholding water, saying that such that move would, quote, usher in an era of conflict that would harm water users in both countries and could spell the end of the treaty itself, end quote.